all right hey guys i'm back and today my name is stomedy and we're gonna play some chivalry and we're just gonna talk about what has just been confirmed like just now like a few good few hours ago battlefield 5 well battlefield 1 has been confirmed i am hyped for that shit but yeah it's set in world war one fucking tanks their first tank british tank is fucking really lovely yeah but yeah i think it's gonna be the best one of the best battlefields out there like when like that's been really because it just looks really good but yeah some chivalry chivalry is it chiv yeah chivalry gameplay and yeah that's what it is and we're also going to talk a little bit about COD Inf Infinite Warfare. I've, I don't think... I'm not going to get it. I'm just not a fan. I've always been more of a fan of Battlefield than COD. But it's an alright... It's an alright trailer, really. Like, I do think it's just like... Oh, fuck. I just realised I'm here. But... It's the card trailer, it's decent. I think Zombies in Space has just fucking ruined it. Infinity Wards. Get your fucking facts right. Ugh. Only Activision can do it properly. Like, really. Mm. Well, I mean, like, their version of Zombies was whatever the fuck it was called in Ghosts. And that was shit. That was shit, that was. But, people have opinions. I've always been more of a fan of Battlefield. Battlefield man all my life. First Battlefield played. Bad company. Fucking sick. But yeah. It, I'm late. I like the way, I like the plot of it how the weird defense league of it the, the, the defense league of England, like not England the globe and they're like basically I, I think it attacks itself like well I think it attacks itself more than anything like global civil war if you get the gist of it but yeah I heard the word Geneva and boom, Switzerland. I guess the first mission set in Geneva. Yeah. I'm going to be probably be talking about Battlefield 1 slash 5. But yeah. Battlefield 1. I am hyped for that. Because it's set in World War 1. I'm like, if you can't clearly tell. The tanks is just one of it. And then you got the horses. And then, fucking hell, I'm, I'm hyped for this shit. But then you got the blimp, that looks really cool. You, you could be able, or it could be like, could be a flight, or it could be a base. Like where you drop down or something. But I imagine the expansion packs are going to be sick. Imagine that shit. Fucking hell. But yeah gonna be fucking amazing. I, I literally just watched it like 10 minutes ago and because Remedy T I hope he does a video on this Battlefield 1 and card in infinite warfare and shit confirmed but I'm way I'm like a lot more excited for Battlefield 1 I'm, I've always been more of a fan of pre not prehistoric eh, not dinosaurs Dinosaur, but I've been I've always been more of a path, uh, more of a fan of past games like Chivalry. I do have to say it's better on PC. Uh, oh well, I killed my own team now. I don't give a shit. But it's just oh, that name got me hyped. I mean, like, I don't think it did for other people, but I just think it. Amazing. 
But that is literally the best trailer I've seen in my life. I'm not fucking like. Oh my god. It is something. But yeah. Yeah. I just searched up now on my phone. I said the United States in World War One declared war on the German Empire on April 6th, 1917, which is pretty much near the end of World War One, if my history keeps me right. The US was an ind was an independent power, but not officially joined the Allies, England, France, etc., etc. But it closely operated military, but but acted alone in diplomacy. The US made its major contra contribution in uh, providing raw resources and materials and weaponry and all that shit and money. But yeah, it, I don't think in the campaign it's going to be an American this time. I think it could be English. It could be French. It could be French. But yeah, they were the main two powers besides Germany. Like, or it could just be like really weird with it and just choose like you can be German or French or England and you can just have different like different campaigns for all of them oh shit or it could just be really weird I don't I don't think they're gonna do this but they could just do it like just online and like Elder Skills online Yeah, but that's mad. But I think the United States isn't going to be in it. I'm like, you might hear of them and supplying resources and all that. But I don't think they're going to be a major thing in the campaign. I don't. But yeah, I think it mainly would be English or French. I'm not too sure. Comment down below what you think. But yeah, yo, it could be. I've just read here. The U.S. mobilized over four million military personnel and suffered a, a, a hundred and ten thousand deaths, including forty-three due to the influenza pandemic. I don't know what the fuck that is, but that could be a thing. But I've also seen in trailer, I literally just watched it. The trailer has got gas, so you're pro there's probably going to be some like thing where you have to find your gas mask. I've seen the minute like the gas dropped, boom, the mask was on. And um, I was also reading a poem about this shit. Uh, it calls Wilfred Owen. Yeah, Wilfred Owen. And, um, yeah, it's just a brutalization of it, like, gas dropping in, they didn't survive because they never put it, they never put the masks on in time and that. Yeah, it's just the tank and the horses is what excites me most, because the tank, the new tank is going to be far from fast, it's going to be literally the opposite of fast. But, yeah, the horses got me excited. They've probably only got, like, one ability with, like, speed up and shit. But, yeah, the expansion packs has got me pretty excited. But, you never know what with these things. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And thank you for 100 subscribers. See you guys in the next one. Peace.